Hey everybody, it's Jesse from Nexus 5 Soft Modder. Today I'm going to show you how to never forget where you parked your car ever again using your Nexus 4. I'm going to show you a really cool app called AutoFinder. Just go to the Play Store and download it. It's free. Um, what makes AutoFinder really great, what really sets it apart from any other app out there, is that it automatically does everything. So there's some car locator apps out there. You download and basically every time you park your car, you just tap a button and it will remember where your car parks using GPS and map, which is very similar to what I have. But this does all that automatically. So once you download and open this app, you actually don't have to do anything ever again because the app runs in the background all the time. And if you're driving and you park your car and you leave, it automatically remembers where you're located. So I think it probably does that by using the GPS and telling when you're accelerating rapidly. And then when you stop, it figures you just drove and you just stopped your car and you parked it somewhere and that you can get back to that location and leave a little bubble so that you can always find it. Um, despite the fact that the app always runs in the background, it actually uses very little battery life. So I had it on all day and I only used about 2% of my battery with this app when I checked it out. So totally negligible, really easy to do. Um, a, cool, a couple cool features in the app is that you can, once you do park your car and you leave it, you can go back to it by tapping the navigation button, which actually opens Google Maps navigation. You can get back to it. It works okay, but it doesn't work quite that well because navigation really isn't set up to find little minute spaces. But the accuracy of the app I actually find is pretty solid. So if you park somewhere and you leave and you come back and you see a little icon, when you're walking toward it, you'll actually go back to the specific spot in the parking lot using the satellite view. And I think that that's pretty amazing. Beyond that, you can tap here to see history of other spots you've gone, or you can change whether or not you want to use simple or satellite. But this is a pretty basic app. There's not a whole lot of settings you can change. You can just change what you want the display to look like again, satellite or simple, or you can go from imperial units to metric. Um, and that's about it. One shortfall of the app is that if you are driving somewhere and you're stopped for a long time, say at a light at an intersection, if where you're going is very near that traffic light, the app's probably going to think, this actually happened to me once, that you parked in the middle of the intersection instead of a minute away wherever you were going. So it's not perfect, it's not foolproof, but it's good enough, it's warranted to download for sure, and you should check it out. That's everything. For the full tutorial, check out Nexus 5 Softmodder. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks.